welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be back planning last week, which was March 19th through the 25th. And I'm going to be using a kit today by Lexi Kylie Designs. I did pick this up last summer, I believe, so it's no longer available in her shop. But this was the birthday kit that she came out with and I fell in love with the colors. Um, so I'll just go through the sheets really quickly. So here we have the page, which is basically all your functional stickers. You do have habit trackers, an extra full box, and some checklists down here. Here you have your full boxes and your quarter, some quarter boxes on the bottom. Here is the bottom washi glitter headers and then some washi strips. And then on this page you have your checklist and some more washi strips on the bottom. Um, here you just have all your half boxes, quarter boxes, um, some headers, and then you have the Monday through Sunday tracker. And then here, I don't know if this came with the kit or if I picked it up, but this is just an extra sheet of half boxes. So yeah, that is the kit that I'm going to be using today. I'm super excited to memory plan this past week because um, if you've watched my other plan with me, as you know that I did celebrate my daughter's birthday this weekend or last weekend. So I'm excited to put that down on paper. But yeah, if you want to go ahead and see how this turns out, then just keep watching. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to run the bottom washi on this side and I did go ahead and white out those lines over there. And when I saw this kit last year, it reminded me of my daughter's because the colors are so fun and bright. And I intended to use them this year for one of their birthdays, but I don't know, I just never got around to using it. So I definitely wanted to um, incorporate it somehow this year because I don't think I'm gonna hold on to it for another year. So yeah, I was gonna use like a more spring themed kit, but I thought I might as well use it because the other birthday that's coming up is my husband's and <laughs> this doesn't really pertain to him, these colors and my birthday and that always falls on the week of Christmas. So who knows what kind of mood I'm going to be in then. I'm pretty sure not a hot pink and purple kind of mood. So yeah, so I thought these would be perfect for celebrating their week. Um, so the kit didn't come with day covers or I didn't pick them up. I'm not really sure. So I did pull some from Rose Colored Days and these are her foiled ones. I thought the banner, the banner date cover would look really pretty, you know, for their birthday. I'll, I don't know. I feel like these are like more fun, cutesy date covers. So I went ahead and added some date dots from Tasseled Planner and Gold Foil as well. So I'm going to go ahead and run these on the dates. And then as far as the glitter headers go, I kind of want to break up all this pink going on. So I am going to lay down this aqua color one, which is one of my favorite colors. So I'm gonna lay those down. I am gonna incorporate all the washi throughout the spread, but I thought for like the main headers, I'll go ahead and use this one. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and lay that all down and I am going to speed you guys up through that part and I will be right back. So this is how it all looks laid down. Um, I did, like I'm probably most likely going to edit that out, but I did start putting them on the wrong days again. So if you saw like the date dots, like trying to get away from me, um, yeah, they were still wet from undo. Um, I, don't, I don't know how I feel about the banners right here at this moment. So I don't know, I guess we will see. Maybe I should have put the pink glitter headers down. Oops, no. Um, instead of the, like the aqua ones, maybe that's what I should have done. Maybe that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna gently pull these up and put the hot pink down. I thought it would be too much pink, but now I feel like the aqua color would look a little bit better throughout the spread than being the main 
glitter header color, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna go ahead and change the glitter headers and I'll be right back. All right, so I went ahead and pulled those up and changed them out for the hot pink and I think it looks so much better. I like that like 100 times better, so I'm glad I did that. So now I'm gonna go ahead and zoom you guys in and we can go ahead and start on Monday. All right, so the first thing that I wanna mark for Monday is of course that it was Coffee Monday. So I think I'm going to take that um, I pulled these from Soda Pop Studio and it's looking a little rough, I know. <laughs> it's been well loved. Um, I want to put it behind some washi and the kit didn't come with like big enough washi strips. I don't feel like stacking them. So I'm going to have to stack some washi anyway. So I'm trying to figure out, I definitely want to use the purple one, probably this one right here. So I think I'm going to take it behind this washi. This washi I got from, I am going to double up on it too. Um, I got this washi from AliExpress, but I do know that you can also get it off Amazon with Prime. So, because with AliExpress, it does take a while to get to you. So, yeah. I'm going to double up on it, but not too much. I just want it big enough that it'll fit the whole script inside of it. That's what I am looking for, but I also want it to be straight. So, let's see about that. I think that should be good enough, right? Yeah, that should be good enough. And I'm gonna take this one right here that says coffee before talky. I feel like I don't use these quite often, probably because they're bigger. Um, I wanna know what went wrong here. And does it look, I feel like it is a little bit crooked. So let's see if I can pull this up without like messing it up too much. Maybe the top one is crooked too, and that's what's throwing me off. Let's see how that looks. I think that looks a little bit better, yeah. So I'm just gonna center this right here, just to kind of mark that I needed that on Mondays, especially on Mondays. I feel like I need, well, I drink more than one cup of coffee, so. Okay, so there we go, that's really pretty. I love the font on that too. Um, and then another thing I want to mark for Monday is that my daughter did go back to school. So she does have some headers. There's not many, but there are some headers in the kit. And ooh, maybe I'll do a, no, because that would have worked if it was spring break, like a this week. I don't want to do a to-do. I would have rather today. So maybe I just need to buy today headers because I use those the most. Um, fine, okay, I'll go ahead and take a glitter header from the kit to kind of divide that section. And I kind of want to take this color here that I like, I laid them out so I can use them again because I was not going to waste all them glitter headers. So I'll put this here just to kind of divide the space up. And then I will put, I want to put a quarter box for that or maybe a washi strip. Hmm something that I can write on that's not too busy or maybe yeah I'm gonna definitely take a washi strip I'm just trying to oh it was on the same page here I'm just trying to find one that's not too busy that I can write on mm, I feel like that's too similar to that I kind of want something maybe I'll just do this purple one this purple polka dot and I'll put it right here because the week before that, she was on spring break. So to mark going back to school, I um, have these. These are from Stationary Heaven, and I'll probably take this pink one. It's like a little like piece of paper and pencil. I think they're really pretty or cute. They're really cute. And I'm gonna stick this little guy over here just to symbolize that she went back to school. And then here, I do wanna take a half box because even though my shop was closed, I spent most of like the first half of the week like working extremely hard to close out all orders. Are these? Oh no, because I had extra ones. Okay, good. Um, I kind of like, I really like this one. But yeah, let's go ahead and take this one. This like little ombre glitter one. And put that here on the bottom and it should fit pretty nicely here. So I'll put that there. And then to mark orders this week, as always, I'm using these bows by Tasseled Planner. And I'm thinking I'm gonna go ahead and go with the hot pink one right now and place that right in the middle. Or do I wanna do purple? 
I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. Okay, I'll probably take the hot pink. Okay. I'm leaning towards purple, but I'm going to take this hot pink right here and push it into the box a little bit more than usual because I don't want it to run up here. And that'll be just a mark that I had to work on orders. I kind of wish I had a lighter pink one, which I should. Mm. Let me go ahead and see if I can pull that out because this is coming off a little bit more brighter than what I want. I don't know if that makes sense, but let me go see if I can find the pink ones. All right, so I couldn't find my pink ones, which I'm kind of worried about because I use those the most. <laughs> but I found like these minty green or blue ones, so that's what I'm gonna use here. And I kind of feel like it matches the glitter header pretty well, so um, that'll have to do because I'm not changing it. <laughs> I'm not changing it again. Okay, so there's that. So for Tuesday and Wednesday, that's where I usually like to focus um, my full boxes on. So I know she has one that says happy birthday that I definitely wanna put on Tuesday, but I just don't know what I wanna put next to it. I was originally gonna go with this one, it's my favorite. I think that's what I'm going to do. I usually, because I can't use all, or I, I can, but I prefer not to use all the full boxes in this, like, uh, spread. So I usually just try to pick the two that are my favorite. So I'll put that one that says happy birthday there, and then I'll put, like, this um, glitter ombre one on Wednesday. And... Try to line it up with the one on Tuesday. Right here. Perfect. Let's see how that looks. Oh, that's so pretty. I feel like I did a, I feel like I did a good choice of this, and I feel like it brings everything together a little bit better. Okay, so we're gonna leave that there, and then I think I want to do glitter headers underneath both of these to kind of section these off. And I think I'm gonna I don't know if I'm gonna do them both purple or if I'm gonna, okay, I'm definitely gonna alternate with them. So I'll do one in this purple color and I'll do one in this aqua color right here. Okay, and then for Tuesday, for Tuesday, I want to definitely put quarter boxes down here. I think I'll focus on these down here. Um, I'll do a hot pink here. And what am I marking for Tuesday? Oh. Of course. Tuesday was my youngest um, daughter's birthday. She turned four. I was really a little bit sad um, because that means like this fall she'll be going back or she'll be starting, um, what is it, VPK? And um, we, or, we want to eventually have another kid, but it's just not happening right now. But um, that means like, I'll be in the house by myself. I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> I'll be so sad. Um, and to mark our birthday, I do want to use one of these munchkins. And I think I'll do the one with the cake. Yeah, I'll do the one with the cake. And put it right there. Funny story, I sent my husband that day to get a cake from... Um, we have like this... I don't, I don't think it's everywhere, but it's Publix. It's like, it's just a grocery store. And... <sighs> never again I should have known he was like <laughs> he was so clueless he was like where do I go for a cake I'm like the bakery like I thought it would be simple enough like a simple enough task that I, I shouldn't have to worry now I know you know after you know when you've been married because we've been married for 10 years you know you just kind of know things you learn through lessons so now I know never to send him to a grocery store anyways he came back with a frozen cake and it was so frozen that we sang happy birthday. We did that whole thing, lit the candle and everything. And then when I, I, I knew I shouldn't have sang happy birthday because it was frozen when I opened it. I knew it was frozen, but I was like, maybe it'll be fine. I cut the cake or I couldn't even cut it. Like I put the knife in it and it like broke, like the frosting was so hard. It broke into pieces. I'm like, where in the bakery did you get this cake? I had to go back up there, get another cake. I came back and my daughter, I was like, okay, now we can have a slice of cake. She was, she was excited, but she was like, um, what'd she say to us? She was like, um, happy birthday. She wanted us to sing happy birthday all over again. We had to do the whole thing. I had to relight the candle, sing happy birthday. And yeah, that was, that was our day on Tuesday. She was, I think she likes being sung too. 
So that's for Tuesday. For Wednesday, I did film. So I'm going to go ahead and put this icon, YouTube icon by Sweet Bella XOXO. And now we know not to send them to the store to get a cake. Because when I went, I had no problem finding a good cake. I'm just putting that out there. I think this is so pretty. I think it goes with this kit so well. So I'm just going to put that there to mark that I did film. And then on Thursday... Hmm. Okay, so I want to put that down there. So I did have to go do groceries that day. So I think I'm going to put that in a washi strip. And... Hmm. I don't know which one I want to use. Or maybe a quarter box? No, I definitely want a washi strip. Maybe I'll do like this mint washi strip here. Because I did go and do groceries just to kind of stock up because we were having company over that weekend. So to mark groceries, I think I wanted to use something from the kit. Yeah. She has um, a lot of functional icons here, which I love. I love this part right here. I think her icons are so cute. And I'm going to take the grocery one. And I will put it right here. And that is just to mark that I went and did groceries that day. And then I had to call my mom. I had to finalize a few things for the party. So I think I want to do a to-do header. Or, you know what? No. I'm going to use a glitter header to separate that. And I'll have to do purple, which is fine. Yeah. I'll do this purple one here. And then I'll do a quarter box, if I can find the quarter boxes. Okay. Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll take, maybe I'll take this one, which is, it kind of matches, well it does, it matches the bottom washi. So I will put that here, because I had to just finalize a few things with her on what she wanted me to buy while I was out grocery shopping. So to mark that, I pulled these phones by Soda Pop Studio. I kind of think I want to do, hmm. I was looking at this color, but like the color in the kit is more of like a mint and that's more of like a turquoise, uh, which is gonna push me to either do purple or pink. So I think I'm gonna lean towards purple since the box is kind of more pink than purple. So I will put that here, and I wanna layer a bow on top of it, just to add a little bit more foil, foil here. I have these from Simply Watercolor Co. These are probably one of my favorites to layer. I just like how skinny they are, and I think I'm have to do a lilac or a pink. Although this mint, okay, let's do this mint since I don't use it that often or as often as I use the pink. So I'll put the mint bow here, and that's just to mark calling my mom. So now here I'm gonna use a work header because I was super, super excited. I met my goal and I was able to finish all my orders on this day. So I'll take that into a half box, and I keep forgetting I have these. Maybe I'll take this purple polka dot one. Is that the one I want to do? Yeah, I'm going to take it right here. And I am going to put a bow like I did before from um, Tasseled Planner. And, ooh, see, I wish I would have found my pink ones. I don't even know. I'm going to have to look. I don't know how I could lose it either. Like, I'm very organized with my storage. So, I don't know how that happened. Hmm. I kind of want to try and see if the pink would work here on this box. I think it will. I think maybe it was the color of the box or where it was. I don't know. But we're going to use this hot pink bow right here. And that is just to mark that I finished all my orders. So, I didn't have to worry about that anymore. And then on Friday... Okay, so call me crazy, but actually that day I didn't even go to bed. Like I finished the orders and then I had groceries still that was like um, in the kitchen and I ended up like 
I'm sure this happens to everyone. I ended up wanting to put the groceries up and then go to bed and then I noticed the fridge needed to be wiped down so I wiped down the fridge and then like a burst of energy came out and I just ended up cleaning like all I didn't sleep. I probably took like a quick nap when my husband came home at like four o'clock in the afternoon but then I had to wake up because my mom was going to be here. Yeah, so anyways, um, I did do a lot of cleaning and I did do laundry. So, okay, so I think I'm going to do that into a quarter box and I'm going to mark laundry first and maybe I'll use, no, because it's mint too. Okay, so let's think about this a little bit. I want to do a print, so let's do, I kind of want to do this one right here, but I feel like I just did that down here. So I'll take this one. I don't know why it's not my favorite. Maybe because the yellow in it, I'm not sure. But I will put this quarter box here. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. Um, I'm gonna mark cleaning here, actually. So to mark cleaning, what was I gonna use? It was in the kit. So I'm sure she has a cleaning, okay, right here. So she has this little bucket with like cleaning supplies and I will put that right here. I kinda wanna layer a bow on top of it. So I'm gonna scooch this up just a little bit so it's over the glitter header, giving me some room to, I'm gonna do the lilac one. Or is that too much? It's never too much. It's never too many bows, I think. <laughs> Um, but I think it is. I think it's a little bit too much. So we're going to scratch that. Let me go ahead and pull this up. All right, so I went ahead and pulled it up and just put the icon down by itself. I think that should be enough. So then I want, ooh, she has a to clean. So even though I just marked that, I'm going to use this to clean header to mark this little section here that I finished all the laundry and I was very excited about that as well. And I think I want to do that into a washi strip. And let's see what she has left. She has a ton of washi strips, which I love about her kits. I think I might want to take... Oh, you know what? Nope. I'm going to use my own washi here. I'm going to use this pink and gold one, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm going to use this... I'm not sure because I have a mint one too, but I'll use the pink one here. And then she does have a script in the kit that says laundry day. So that's what I'm gonna put here. Um, let's see, so it's right here, it's really cute. And it just says laundry day on it. So I am going to put that here in the middle to symbolize that I did that. because It was definitely a laundry day. Perfect, okay. And then down here, I'm gonna put a glitter header and I really don't wanna put this one because the mint is right there. Maybe I'll take, no, I definitely wanna do a glitter one. So I'll take this lilac one here and then I'm going to put, ooh, I didn't wanna have two half boxes together it's gonna bother me a lot. So I'm gonna switch this around, so I'll be right back. Actually, I'm not going to switch this around. What I'm gonna do is I'm just going to put this washi strip down, but first I do want to um, cover the bottom up because there's gonna be a little bit too much white space. I'm gonna use this polka dot washi. It had, just has like, it's gold full of dots and it has different like pastel colors. And I got this washi from, I wanna say Joann's. I'm pretty sure that's where I got it from. And then that way I can layer this right here. And then I'm just going to mark that my mom came. So this is really exciting. Oh, was I going to use that? Oh, well. Okay, so I have these house also by Lexi Kylie Designs. Um, they're one of my favorite. <laughs> and I'm going to have to order more because I want to use a pink one maybe i'll do this hot pink one i'll put it on mm, yeah i'll put it on this side over here she my mom came and my brother came and my nephew 
and yeah, that was fun. So I'm going to put that there. I kind of want to put a bow, but I'm just going to chill out for a little bit there with the bows. And I'll add it in the end if I feel it needs it. So that is it for Sat or Friday. So for Saturday was the day of the party. It was so much fun. Um, and I definitely want to take that into a half box. And I don't want to do that. Okay. So I have these half boxes. I need the other ones too. And I have these. I kind of want to take it into a plain one, to be honest. There's not like a plain purple, which there's one with like a cupcake, but I feel like that would be a little ex excessive. But I could. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe I'll do a mint. Because I definitely want it to be plain. So I'll do this mint one. I don't know why I'm having reservations about this, but that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take this mint half box here, and then I'm going to take this banner that she has in the kit. I was going to take a different one, but I think this one would be perfect, to be honest with you. So I'm going to take the banner here, and then I'll just write in that it was their birthday. I was going to do a little heart, but maybe I... No. I actually pulled these bows to use. Or maybe, I'll, you know what? I'll do one of Simply Watercolors. <laughs> wow. Simply Watercolor Co's bows. And I'll do a pink one. And I'll put it right here. Just to mark their birthday party. Which was super fun. We had so much food. My mom woke up early. And me and her cooked. And then there was like so many people came. And it was our first time like having a birthday party at this house or even like here. I usually go to like my mom, like where my mom's at, where she lives. But yeah, that was fun. So, um, okay. So I think the next thing that I want to mark after that was that we had family time. And what did I want to mark for that? Okay. So I'm going to take that behind some washi again. And I have... Or I'm going to use the same one. So we ended up, um, yeah, I'm going to put this here. We ended up, like, we got a bouncy house for the kids, which was super fun. Um, I totally went in there. <laughs> so did my husband. So not just for the kids. And there was a lot of food, and there was a really good cake. My mom um, has this lady that makes cakes. And I'm going to put a munchkin family time. I'm probably going to take this purple one. I don't know how to explain the cake. Um, I call it, like in Spanish, I call it, call it wet cake. I've never, and I may be wrong, but my grandma, or I've only been, I've only been served this cake when I am at a Spanish person's party like I've never had the cake anywhere else I don't know if it's like a Spanish thing but it's not not everyone makes this kind of cake it's basically rum cake is what it is I mean there's alcohol in it but it burns off anyways the cake ends up really wet and sweet it, just, it was so good so we had some of that so we were still eating off of it to be honest because we had two different cakes okay and then after that like when everyone left and stuff I'm going to take a glitter header to divide that. Um, when everybody left and stuff, we... Or do I want to take a washi strip? No, I'll do this. We, um... Like, my nephew, so my brother's son, since they were staying the weekend, they were still here. And we just ended up watching movies and stuff. What did we watch? When the kids were up, we watched... Emoji Movie. That's my nephew's favorite. And then when the kids went to bed, I'm on this like Marvel kick now since I've watched, what is it, Black Panther? <laughs> now I'm just like, me and my husband are trying to watch like all the movies that pertains to the new Avenger movies that's coming up. I forgot what stone they're looking for. But that's what we've been watching. So we watched Gardens of the Galaxy because that one has a stone in it. The first one. I want to take some washi down here. I think there's too much white space for what I like. I can always do a washi strip, but I feel like I don't. I don't want to. Um, maybe I do. I don't have 
that many washi strips left. Oh, I do. Okay, let's think about this again. Maybe I'll take this one. Okay, I'll definitely do that. And I want some washi down here so that I'll take the same one because um, there's too much white space down there. Anyways, we're trying to watch all the movies that has the stones. I forgot what stone it is. So we ended up watching Guardians of the Galaxy. And then Sunday we watched Captain America, the first one. I just want to know where like all the stones are prior to going to watch the new Avengers movie. That makes sense. So I'm going to put that there just to kind of mark that we had movie night. I'm going to take these popcorns by Hello Petite Paper. And I'm going to take the pink one. And I will put that over here. I'm definitely putting a bow on this. No, because I just did a bow there. I really want to, though. Maybe like a mint green one. Mm. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to put it down a little bit. And that's just to mark that we watched a few movies that night. Okay. So for Sunday. Um... Okay, so I did do some filming that day since I wasn't able to, like all this craziness was going on, I wasn't able to film. So I did end up filming on Sunday. So I am going to put this here and then to mark filming, ooh, what did, did I pull something? I have these, but I don't know if I wanna use these by um, Wild Sunshine. Um, I kinda do but I kind of want to use another one of those. Yeah, I'm going to use another YouTube icon from Sweet Bella XOXO, and I will put it over here, because it's so pretty. It matches the kit, too. Okay, and then what else did I do that day? I had a super lazy day. Like, I, it was, it was a bad lazy day. Like, we watch movies all day and stuff. So, I think... Okay. So, I want to do... Maybe I'll do an aqua glitter header. Or maybe... What half boxes do I have left? Because then that will let me know. Um, Where's my... Oh. Okay. So, I'll take this washi strip just to kind of... Whoa, wait. I might want to use this down here because it's my favorite washi strip. Okay, I'll do a glitter header. Um, I kind of want to do this aqua. I don't know how I feel. Mm, I'm going to do it because I feel like I just used a purple over here. So I'll take this aqua glitter header and I do want to take a half box because I feel like the worst person ever. I didn't notice until I edited my plan with me for last week, but you guys... I forgot to mark my mom's birthday. Uh, you guys don't know how bad I felt. I'm gonna take this half box here that matches the washi. I felt so bad. My mom actually follows me on Instagram, so I'm hoping she doesn't notice. I don't think she will, but yeah. She doesn't watch my videos, but she does follow me on Instagram. Hopefully, she. I don't think she'll notice at all. Sometimes I've written in like surprises for her and she has no idea. Okay, so I'm gonna put those balloons from the kit to mark my mom's birthday. I'm so sorry, mom. I did not mean to. Okay, and then here, I wanna take this Lazy Day script and I don't know, I feel like I've been using this washi so I might as well continue that, but I have this mint one too. Hmm, what do I wanna do? Okay, maybe I'll just continue with this one. I'm gonna double up on this one down here. Yeah, that'll be fine. And I'm gonna straighten this out. I felt so bad when I was editing my video. I'm like, what kind of daughter am I? I marked second half, but I didn't, <laughs> I didn't mark my mom's birthday, but I love her. She actually ended up leaving Sunday pretty early like before I woke up, so I wasn't able like to say happy birthday in person, but I called her and stuff, so. Okay, so I'm gonna put that washi down there, and then I'm gonna put this Lazy Day sticker from the kit, because that is exactly what happened the rest of the day. 
and I'm going to try to center it here. Perfect. I love how this came out. Okay. So over here, I know she has some headers. Oh, yes. Maybe I want to use this week over here. So maybe I'll do a glitter header here. I'll do the purple one. The purple, where are they? Where, okay, right here. So I'll do the purple glitter header up here. I'm going to flip you guys over. If that bothers you, I'm so, so sorry, but um, it's the only way I can get stickers straight. I say this every week, but in case someone new is watching. Okay, and then I'm going to put the Monday through Sunday right here. It's not my favorite print. I don't know why. Hmm. Okay. So the other full um, checklists have this same print too anyway, so... We're just gonna have to deal with it. So I'll put this right here, this thing, this um tracker thing. <laughs> that wasn't even better than what I said before. And I wanna take this washi strip. I'm kind of debating whether I should do bows first and then a washi strip. Okay, I'm gonna do the bows first. Um, I have this hot pink and gold one from Simply Gilded. And when I'm filming this, it is, what day is today? Wednesday. So today she had her Easter baskets up. Did you guys get one? Um, let me tell you about my day with that. So I woke up. I'm just going to do it like this. I woke up, you know, took my daughter to school and had my cup of coffee. And I was like, ooh, today's the Easter basket. So I go in literally from like 8 a.m., or like nine, to be honest with you, till like one or two in the afternoon. I was refreshing Etsy. Yeah. And I'm like, I don't even know what I'm looking for or any of this stuff. And <laughs> uh, I, I don't know. I, I mean, I wanted one, but I didn't like have to have one. I'm sure there was other people that needed washing more than I did. But if I happened to stumble upon it, it would have been nice. That's the mood I was in. But I, you guys, I was refreshing Etsy. It wasn't until I went on Instagram and I was looking at like my stories. I don't know whose I watched. But they were like, oh, I'm trying to get this box. Or like, you know. And I look at the website and I'm like, that doesn't look like Etsy. I went on Shopify and I was like, oh. You know what? I got confused because her pre-orders are on Etsy. And I, I don't know. I just got confused. So, yeah. I spent most of the half of my morning refreshing the wrong <laughs> website. I'm like, man, when is it going to come on? I didn't get one, which is fine. I'll survive. Um, I kind of wish this was more, like, more washy. Oh, you know what? You guys, look. Look at this. This would have been perfect. So I'm gonna pull this up. But yeah, I'm interested. I'm definitely excited to see if anyone got it, like what was in it. Um, I'm a sucker for mystery stuff. I am. I, like, I, I don't know. I like things that are le left up to faith, like a surprise kind of thing, even though I'm the worst person to like um, try to be surprised. You know what? I gotta go get my scissors, so I'll be right back. Alright, so anyways, like I was saying, I like to be surprised, so I liked that element kind of drew me in. But when I realized that I was basically stalking the wrong site, I just laughed. <laughs> like, I don't know, and I, I wasn't able to snag one, so it was fine. But I'm really interested to see what's in it, so... Yeah, I'm excited to see when people start receiving those. Okay, so that's how that looks down there, which I like. So I'm going to go ahead and white these out now. All right, so I went ahead and whited those out, and I am going to put a full box down here. So I really want to do this one. I think it's so pretty, and that is the one I'm going with because it's my third favorite. Even though there's cut bags up there, we'll live. We will live. So I'm going... I did like the crappiest job of whiting out, which what's new. Okay, 
I'm gonna center this right here as best as I can. Right here, perfect. I feel like there's a little bit right there. Okay, perfect. And then down here, I feel like I say the same thing every week. <laughs> But I literally plan the same style every week, which I love, though. I love that. Um, I'm going to take an aqua glitter header. I'm going to turn this upside down. And I'm just going to line this up with this full box here. Make sure it's straight. And then I'm going to put a half box down there. I just like to mark my highlight of the week. And I think I'm going to take this hot pink one. In reality, only because it's squared. Okay, that's not a good enough reason. <laughs> I want it to be a prettier half box than that, and I don't want it to be hot pink. So, hmm. Maybe I'll take this one with the balloons, is what I'm thinking. No, I don't know what half box I want to take. I was so sure three seconds ago, and now I'm not. Um... Okay, I kind of like this one better. It has a print in the background. It's white. Uh, so I will put this, center this half box here in the middle. And then down here, I'm going to put, I'm actually going to cut up, like I kind of want to cut up a, um, what you call it? A full box. But now I feel like with this white box, I can't. Maybe I can cut this one up. I can always put washi down, but I think that would look so much cuter. So hopefully I won't cut it down too small. And we can try this. I'm just gonna eyeball it because if I mess up, I have more of the half box to work with. Let's see. Let me actually turn this around. Oh yeah, that'll be perfect. So I will put that here. And then up here, I'm going to put a This Week header. And she has one right here. I'm going to turn it around one last time. I feel like this spread is so fun. I love it. I love planning with brighter colors. I think it's so pretty. Okay, so I'm going to put a This Week header here. And that should be it. So let me go ahead and zoom you guys out. All right, so this is how it looks all laid down. I love it. I can't, you guys, I almost changed the um, date covers when I had like the other glitter headers because I really wasn't sure, but I feel like that was such a good decision to do that. Um, what I want to do now that I forgot to do is two things. I feel like I pulled them. Where'd they go? Um, well, I definitely want to add a banner here and a bow. So let me find the bows. All right, so in the corner here, I usually use deco, but I don't have any. I'm gonna take this bow clip. This is from my newest addiction, and I'm gonna take this like ombre one, which I think matches perfectly with this kit, and it's in gold foil. And I'm just gonna pop this in the corner here at an angle, and then I can write my thought for the week or whatever. Here, I think I wanna play around with this, with these um, banners. These are by tasseled planner and I thought it would look really cute but I don't want it to cover the cupcake so maybe I'll do what I was originally going to do and just I think it's so pretty though I really want to use it as just like deco maybe I'll put it down here I wanted it down here originally but that didn't work out mm, okay we'll just it's just not going to work which is fine which is fine. So I'm actually gonna take some of these bows and put them in places where I feel it needs it. So I feel like I want one on this corner, just kind of like to add deco. And I think we're bow, we have enough bows on this side to be honest with you. Hmm. I do have this pink one just laying here. But I feel like, yeah, I feel like it's okay. Like, I don't need to add any more. 
Less is more, Amy. Less is more. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and fill this all out. Um, I am going to use my tool pen again, just cause it's right here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and fill this all out and I will be right back with you. All right, so this is how it looks all filled out. I really do love it. I think it's so pretty, it's so bright, and I feel like this was the perfect kit to mark celebrating both of my daughter's birthdays. Um, any, like any shops that I mentioned, I'm gonna go ahead and leave all those links down below as well as any codes that I do have. I did go ahead and add this bow from my shop and then this little clip that I just made for myself. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, subscribe and stick around, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.